Yo guys, what is up, Davis here. So I thought I'd make another video. I haven't made one for a while. It's been like a month or so. But uh, yeah, I thought I would show you guys this console right here. This is an order. And I just finished this one tonight. I washed it all up so it's clean and everything. And you know, it's, it's really hard to find a glossy console that isn't, you know, it's all scratched up. But this one, it's not, like it has some scratches, but it's not terrible. So I went ahead and did the cutout that the customer wanted, um, which is the spiderweb cutout. And I don't have it hooked up to the TV right now, but I'm just going to turn it on just to show you the LEDs. Uh, it's not going to boot up because I don't have the HDMI plugged in or the TV turned on. So, but like my my desk is a mess because I just I've had so many orders. I have 116 orders to do and ship out before Christmas. So. I just thought I'd tell you guys, but all the orders will be shipped out before Christmas. Um, I just have so much stuff to do. I've been having two computers at the same time, RDHing consoles, so I could get it done faster. So, um, but yeah, I mean, if you guys saw my other videos, you would see, you know, or my other videos or my Instagram, you know, you would see that my shelves were full and they're just all the consoles are disappearing so um, and like this changes all the time probably besides those red ones those are always there but um, yeah I just I have so much stuff to do I got more hard drives in these are all send-ins that I need to open up and go through and I'll have more send-ins down there and then two more actually uh, I think four more that that little package down there is a hard drive so um, yeah I've just been so freaking busy. It's a mess down here. I'm going to be cleaning it up this weekend. Uh, these are more send-ins I have to do. That's also a send-in. And... Yeah. And I'm slowly making my money back on this machine that I bought. The CNC machine. Um, you guys can see other videos of that. Uh, you know, cutting out consoles and stuff like that. Go to my other videos to watch all that. But this thing... For the machine itself, it was like $4,000. I had to get a new bid for it because the old bid, which is down here, it's like it's wooden and it doesn't have the little grooves in it, so I can't lock stuff in place. Uh, that bid just by itself was like 300 bucks. And then for the enclosure, it was $1,000. So I have pretty much $6,000 in this entire thing. Uh, and it's. This enclosure itself, I put together this thing, and it was a bitch to put together by yourself. Because these doors, like, they fall out. Ignore that. But these doors fall out, and it's fucking ridiculous. So, um, but yeah. Um, see what else I can show you guys and give you an update on. Um, oh, there we go. This is a good thing. If you guys didn't see my live stream on Instagram the other day, uh, I bought a lot on eBay. It was six consoles. Five of them were Jaspers and one of them was a Zephyr. And, you know, I hook them up, test them. And they, all five of the Jaspers are demo kits. Now, I'm not really sure what the difference between a demo kit and a dev kit is. I've heard that these are just made to, like, test games and stuff. Um, I don't really know about all that stuff, but... Uh, they came with the power brakes, and these are like the black ones for, um, they're like, they're not gray. I'm not really sure what they're for. I think they're for like the Xenons or something, uh, but they're for the dev kit. You know, you can see the difference. Like they have the gray button. That's the original gray that you would see on a power brake. And these are, uh, two, oh, 213 watt power brakes. So I have, uh, six of those. One of them is one of the plug-in ports are like broken though i guess they got broken during shipping or something i'm not sure but i got the lot for like 157 bucks for all six consoles and then when i hook them up it says uh xbox development kit so i definitely scored on that um but like look at over here it is a mess like it is terrible um i got a, an action camera a new one a 4k action camera i'm currently recording on my phone but I made some videos with the Xbox One X and like opening it up and stuff and I just I haven't even had time to edit those videos or anything so um, but yeah I'm just I've been working my ass off getting
getting everything done. So, but yeah, this this thing needs to uh, this place needs to be cleaned up bad. Um, and also, I got some bad news. I guess it's kind of a, it's good news for my my grandma at least. She would like to take it down, but if this tarp you guys see this all the time probably. This tarp right here is inside of here is my paint booth, and it's just the whole room uh, with paint cans and everything. Then it has a window that blows it outside. It works really good. Uh, the downside of that is that over there is run on a flame so if fumes were to get out of there which it would take a lot of fumes but if it were to go up in there and then the flame were to uh you know to ignite it would fucking blow everything up so but anyway i'm taking this down and i really don't want to take it down because i put a, i put this up myself and it was a lot of work a lot of time putting it up um but yeah this will be taken down this weekend as well and I'm gonna have some probably some tables or something over there and I'll have more room because I need more room so but yeah guys uh, thanks for watching and yeah y'all have a great day and check out my other videos oh and by the way I will be starting orders again on the 26th of December so right now I'm not taking any orders that's what I forgot to tell you guys so now you guys have a good day, and I appreciate you guys watching. See you later.